This video may not be appropriate for children of 13 and under. Parental discretion is advised.
it's Raziel Kane, and uh, thank you for watching that uh, little montage, uh, which is really just, you know, a thousand percent uh, fast forward for speed uh, on me reassembling this. And I just wanted to show you a little bit uh, what the end uh, result is. Although it's not complete a hundred percent because there is, uh, there, bleh, there is some stuff that we still need to. Uh, arrange but uh, at least I'll give you the new uh, collection display all right all right starting with the new area uh, of course my grandizer um, there used to be a lot more bots here but when I you know hit the table some of them fell down so I got new shelves so my poster the lamp's gonna go but I still have my scaling poster so that when I'm doing research on characters and stuff, it's right there. Here you have a shot of my dad when I opened the door and he was surprised. Uh, I put uh, some of the uh, pictures, Paul Lighting, you have Greg Berger. And uh, so basically, if you go, this is my season one stuff. So the Dinobots and Snarl's gonna go there. You have the art crew and uh, some Cybertronian modes. Then I have my Beast Wars uh, Predacons. Uh, over here you have my Season 2. It's kind of hiding the posters. I didn't think of that, but, you know, live and learn. So, all the guys from Season 2. Although Rewind and Eject should really be in my movie display, but... And then you have my Beast Wars. Still missing a Cheetor, hoping that they're going to release a Transmetal 2. You have my movie display, and then my season three edition, the Lambros, which they look freaking good. And yeah, I've put the uh, alternators back in the uh, alt mode because uh, yeah, it, it, they look super goofy. And then I have my obscure Autobots, you know, different continuity, R.I.D., Prime, and Die Clone, and War for Cybertron stuff. And then you can see all at the bottom you have my X-Men, well, mostly X-Men comic books, Wolverines, and you have all my D&D stuff, custom campaigns, rule books. And then I have, like, a whole shelf just for the Decepticons. So now I was able to set that in two shelf, like for Season 1, because it was getting a little back up here. So... Of course, my masterpiece of a Jinbao Devastator. Love that thing. They have my Seekers, my Season 2 stuff. Season 3 and movie. And then Obscure, other line of Transformers. And then G2 Legend, Leftovers, Headmasters. My G1 Skull Grand. And then you have my... Super nice wings of these guys with the chibi girls from Mukudu. And I'm kind of disappointed they announced a, th a fourth figure and uh, it's Optimus Prime. I was really hoping they were going to just do the girls, you know. Oh, I have my Venus there though, right there. And uh, G1 Classic and uh, Elita want to keep company to Optimus Prime. And then you have my Jada Toys, my Monopoly, and some Tiki Cups. Still haven't uh, heard from, uh, you know, the Series 3 of those. Can't wait. And then you have my books, which is the Wheel of Time, with some other stuff in the back, like The Expanse. Uh, if you haven't read the Wheel of Time, read the Wheel of Time. And then my Dungeons & Dragon books, with uh, my Hyperion stuff, and the Zombie Survival Guide, of course. And then you have my, you know, other leftover Transformers, Ultra Magnus, who's been moved out of the movie shelf because of Studio Series 86. Some uh, goddamn spiral always on her back. And the Dice Links. And the last wave, uh, the third wave, is late. And I'm tired. So I still have a couple of shelves uh, empty. Uh, you know, so I'm going to... Add some more. So basically, yeah, this is the new uh, display, the new stuff. My review area. Kind of small, eh? That uh, don't need much more. So there you go. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this uh, quick uh, look at my uh, updated uh, display. My new basement, basically. Hey, everything's white. 
and look at my floor my floor is pale so it looks roomy i can't show you behind me because well that's gonna suck so there you go thanks for watching i hope you've enjoyed this if you did please like subscribe and hit the bell also leave a comment love reading those keep coming back i have more on the way and remember nothing in life gives you right to be an asshole take care i'm flexing